in the southern Appalachians it's not all that rare to find trails that are kind of grown up in the summertime. So it's always good to carry a stick because a good part of these plants are nettle. And nettle makes your legs really, really itch and sting. My mom always told me when uh, life gives you problems, just look around. God's got the solution for you. Probably growing right next to it. But this is nettle. See the little thorns on the side of the plant? That's what makes you sting. And growing right next to it is a whole patch, beautiful patch of jewelweed. And jewelweed is this soft plant that has an aloe-like quality to it. When you pull it up from the roots, it has a red bottom to the root. And inside this wonderful, beautiful plant is this wonderful antidote for poison ivy, for yellow jacket stings, for nettle stings. This is what I smush up and carry around with me when I'm hiking through nettle. This is what I carry with me when I walk in high, on hikes that are full of nettle. I just smush up some jewelweed and carry it in my hand and that way when my legs start itching I just rub some on them and the itching goes right away. It's wonderful stuff. And this is another good reason to carry jewelweed. Jewelweed prevents poison ivy. You can either put it on your legs before you walk through poison or after you walk through poison within about an hour and it will usually negate the effects of the poison ivy. It's a really wonderful plant.